Life is good all this month at Appalachian Wireless. Get the LG G5 for just one penny with sign-up or renewal of a two-year service agreement. That's almost $100 off the regular price. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Inmates in the Pike County Detention Center's work release program have been out working hard after last week's severe weather, from fixing broken fences to cutting and moving fallen trees. However, today inmates turn their attention to an abandoned graveyard at Hurricane Creek in Pike County. Officials say the graveyard on Elisha Fork hasn't been touched in 30 years. It's a mess, but uh, we're up there cleaning it. There's a lot of graves up there. they got lots of trees on them. And we're just going to pretty much clear, clear cut it. And uh, within a, a day, maybe in a few hours, uh, we'll have it cleaned up and be respectful again. The work release program cleans more than 200 grave sites per year. We like to find these ones that's been ignored and bring them back to life. And that's exciting to see some of these graveyards that hasn't been touched in 20, 30, 40 years to see all the old stones. While graveyards typically take up the most time, the Pike County Detention Center keeps Pike County Schools a priority. Fred has me going out and making sure the kids in the schools come first. Uh, we make sure they're clean, they're grass. What we've been doing uh, Friday, we did Shelby Valley's trees this morning, Pikeville Elementary's trees that have fallen down. And one of Freddie's big thing is to make sure we do the schools first. There are 47 work release inmates at the Pike County Detention Center. Reporting in Hurricane Creek for EKB News, I'm Shelby Steele.